Islamic worshippers in the western suburbs have been left saddened and confused after an attack at their local mosque. Dozens of Korans were destroyed in the random act of vandalism in Deer Park. Rob Scott reports. For many Muslims, this is the ultimate act of desecration. More than 30 Korans destroyed in an attack that goes right to the heart of their religion. We believe that that is the word of God, so that is God's word. And not only do we believe that, but we wash ourselves before we touch it. The holy books were torn to shreds, allegedly by this man. Security cameras at the Australian Bosnia Islamic Centre captured the man entering the mosque on Thursday afternoon. He headed straight for a dining area where an elderly woman was preparing food alone. Demanding to see an imam, she says he terrorised her. A lady who was behind there, she knew she was trapped. Leaving her cowering in the kitchen, she says the man then went on a 30-minute rampage. Removing dozens of Korans from shelves, he ripped them to pieces, scattering the pages in the prayer room. We can't even call them Korans once they're ripped. You know, once a single letter is out, it, it's no longer considered to Korans. Not content with just tearing up the Korans, the man even shoved some of them down the toilet bowls, even twisting some of them in half to make sure that they fit down the drain. Mahia Pasevic believes this is the act of just one disturbed individual and not the work of a racist group. Afraid of repercussions, he's now calling for calm among the Islamic community while police investigate. Rob Scott, Nine News.